In this video, we'll be talking about a six-stroke engine and kind of breaking down each stroke and what it does. During the first stroke, the intake of pure air into the cylinder is injected, and an uh, intake value valve is opened. During the second stroke, which is where the piston is moving up, is the compression of pure air into the heating chamber, and the heating chamber valve is open. So during the first and second strokes, the air combustion chamber can receive injection of fuel and ignition is triggered. Uh, in the third stroke, which is the first of the two power strokes, um, it is a release of combustion gas into the cylinder. This pushes the valve or the cylinder head down, and the combustion chamber valve is open. During the fourth stroke, is the exhaust of the combustion gases is pushed out, and um, the exhaust valve is opened. So during the third and fourth stroke, the temperature of the pure compressed air in the heating chamber is raised sharply by the heat exchange from one from the combustion chamber. The second and last power stroke is the fifth stroke and uh, it releases it releases a pure heated gas into the cylinder. And in the sixth stroke is the recompression of pure heated gas into the combustion chamber. So during the fifth and sixth strokes air is moved from heating chamber into the combustion chamber. So compared to a four stroke engine which only has four strokes and one power stroke this six stroke engine has six strokes and two power strokes and is supposed to be 40% more efficient than a normal four stroke engine.